about a magnificent movie that grabs you and really does not let you go. Going on, everybody. Welcome back to a brand new movie review. Today, I'm going to be discussing Shirley, which stars the likes of Michael Stolenberg, Elizabeth Moss, Logan Lerman, and of course, Odessa Young. It's about a famous horror writer who finds her inspiration for her new book after she and her husband take in a young couple. Once again, this is one of the movies that came out at Sundance 2020 this year, and I sadly missed it. And I wish I didn't because holy crap, this was an amazing movie and probably would have been one of my favorite movies from Sundance because my god, it just grabs you and doesn't let you go for any point in time in this movie and just the storytelling capabilities is actually one of the most unique things about this, whether it's from the writing, the directing, and then when you add on top of this the excellent acting this is one of those films that just really takes your breath away. Of course, if you guys are new here, though, make sure you're going to hit that like and subscribe button so you don't miss out on content like this on a daily basis, as well as comment down below. And let me know what your guys' thoughts. Are you guys excited for this movie? Are you not? I'm really curious to hear your guys' thoughts on this one in particular. It's going to be an interesting discussion for sure. Talking about this movie, this is a tough movie to kind of maneuver because there's so many different particular things that really stick out about it. Kind of just going from a technical standpoint first, the editing and everything around that is just phenomenal. But the the score in general also is really fantastic and really adds an eerie tone to this sensation and the way that the story is being told is quite confusing and up until even maybe the last few minutes of the film where it finally hits its stride and really hits you and you're like all right i get it and movies like that when you actually have to play along and actually sit there and go along with it it feels more rewarding by the end and i think that's something that the director does so well in here josephine decker the director of this really just takes this concept and runs with it the way that she's able to film and her decision to film handheld for a majority of the film is actually quite impressive and adds this weird off-centered feel to the movie it really makes you feel like you are personally with these characters and I really appreciate how they were able to bring that about inside this movie. Nowadays I feel like we don't get this kind of artistic independent look when it comes to biopics and in a biopic like this where again when you hear biopic you're like ah I've seen so many of these all the time before ones like this are told in such an interesting way. Chris Gubin's screenplay in here is also something to really be a remarkable thing as well. It's a script that really just gives the actors time Time to chew on the scenery it never it takes its time with every single scene and never feels like it's being rushed out of the way and I really appreciated that in so many different moments again this is where we get down to the performances I mean the performances Michael Stolenberg is just having a hell of a time eating the scenery with the rest of the cast inside of here and that's something that I love is Michael Stolenberg is just one of the best actors like working as a supporting cast he always nails it and always gives such great performance but really Logan Lerman great as well love seeing him back in here didn't even know he was in the film until I started the movie but truly the two biggest big show-stopping performances in here is Elizabeth Moss who now I feel cements herself into top five actresses working today but Odessa Young is brilliant she could have easily been overshadowed by Moss but rivals her performance with another brilliant one this is a fantastic performance I would even go as far as to say I think Odessa Young has the most amount of work to deal with in this film i think she has the most gravitas in this film to go about and i think odessa young is absolutely a remarkable star and i cannot wait to see what she does next i am absolutely truly stunned by the performances in here i think if there's any other reason to see this film other than the directing and the writing it is absolutely because of the cast the cast is phenomenal the most unique thing about shirley is that while after i ended it i went that was a really good movie the more that I've come to think about it, the more that I kind of come to love it and every different aspect that it really portrays. It's such an experimental biopic that's told in such a unique way from all the directional stuff, all the technical stuff, and even from the performances. It's one that keeps you second guessing till the very end and contemplating throughout the whole thing of how you feel about this movie. It's one that oozes with horror, one that oozes with an eerie atmosphere but one that is absolutely just great. If you are new here again, make sure you're going to hit that like and subscribe button. Comment down below and let me know your guys' thoughts. What are your guys' thoughts on this? Do you guys enjoy this movie? Did you not? Let's discuss it all the way down below in the comment section as well as hit that like and subscribe button so you never miss it on content like this on a daily basis. Thank you guys again so much for clicking on this video. If you guys are new here as well as hit on over to see how much on films on how to see films early. And of course, it's a big thank you to you and a big thank you to my Patreon supporters because without you, I wouldn't be able to do this. It really is a magnificent movie. It, it really is. It's one that really just brought me to another world. 
and just made me live in it for a, this creepy, eerie atmosphere that I just kept second guessing myself and contemplating what is going on throughout this whole entire thing. The scenery, every single part of the cinematography is great. The score adds so much tension to every single scene. And in general, the way that this story is told is probably my favorite absolute thing. And one of the most unique things that I've seen this year alone for 2020 films, it's one film that I wish I didn't miss at Sundance. It's one I wish I would have gone to and would have made time for and it really is just a unique and amazing film in that right. Performances are absolutely stunning. Stolenberg and Logan Lerman are just absolutely great. I love them both as actors, but truly the big showcase is Moss and Odessa Young. I don't know who did a better job. Elizabeth Moss kind of cements herself as one of the best actresses working today, and Odessa Young, well, I've never really seen her in anything before this, but she's going to be on the mark now. She's incredible in this. This is a movie that's just absolutely phenomenal, and it's one of the best films of 2020 so far. So with all that said, I'm going to give Shirley an A. Let me know your guys' thoughts down below. Are you guys excited for this movie? Are you not? I'm so curious to hear your guys' thoughts. Have you already seen it? Were you at Sundance and saw it? Let's discuss it down below, guys. It's out on VOD this week. I hope you guys do get to check it out. Many more movie reviews coming up soon. So thank you guys again so much for watching this. And of course, until next time, stay classy.